local township leaders can breathe a sigh of relief knowing their positions are safe for this year. Indiana lawmakers voted against a House bill eliminating township advisory boards. A 2007 report suggested getting rid of townships altogether. Since then, lawmakers have taken steps to try to make that a reality. News 10's Garrett Brown is live in Pearson Township. He has more on how your local government is fighting to keep your townships alive. This fire, volunteer fire department behind me is funded with the help of Pearson Township, a township along with many across the Hoosier state that has been on edge because of that house bill that could have removed its advisory boards. Rick Long is the trustee of the Lost Creek Township. For weeks, local officials like Long have been voicing opposition to House Bill 1650. The bill would have removed township advisory boards, leaving trustees to handle all the township business. Who's going to oversee our, our expenses and our funds and who's going to oversee me to make sure that we're doing it correctly. Uh, so they were happy to see that it was defeated. Representatives voted down that bill earlier this week. This wasn't the first attempt to get rid of township positions. Some feel getting rid of the boards would be the first step in eliminating townships altogether. We are the eyes and the ears of our local area. People come to us and we listen to them. And if you move this thing to the county, County officers are eight to four. House Representative Bob Heaton voted in favor of the bill. He says there have been many issues with the township system. Heaton wants to see that changed. But you've got some, uh, a lot of fraud, corruption in the, in, uh, in bigger, bigger townships, but all over. We got to take a look at that. Trustees like Long hope the state will take a closer look at their efforts and how they can improve instead of removing a vital resource from the community. The best government is the local government's closest to the people because I believe there can be improvement in any government office in any private industry. But let's take our time and make sure we're doing it correctly and what's best for the township and for the people. There are a few bills that could still help or could alter the townships a little bit. One of those being transferring ownership of cemeteries and maintaining them over to the county. Reporting live in Blackhawk on News 10's Garrett Brown, back to you.